Hello and welcome to day 24, 25, 25 of May, Myself and I. I really need to start keeping track. Today I'm drinking a little celebratory can of Pims because yesterday I ran the Vitality 10K and it's one of the best things I've ever done. So the reason I'm gonna talk about this in today's May, Myself and I is because the word today is moon and yesterday I essentially full mooned the entirety of London as I ran through it in my knickers. So for those of you that don't know, although I don't know how you don't know because I've literally been talking about it everywhere, I ran the Vitality 10K yesterday as part of the Celebrate You campaign, which was all about embracing your body and the fact that you can run and exercise no matter your body shape or your body size, doesn't matter anyone can run, anyone can exercise. So over 19,000 people yesterday ran the Vitality 10K, but a thousand women ran in their undies and their sports bras. And oh, it was just so good. It was so good. I sewed flowers onto my pants. In fact, let me get them, let me show you. The night before the race, I spent three hours sewing, <laughs> sewing flowers to the front of my pants, because on the back, is my name. These flowers are actually from the garlands that they give you when you walk into the Polynesian Resort in Disney World. <laughs> so I had three garlands and so I had to cut them up and spread the flowers quite evenly, as evenly as I could. This side definitely has less flowers than this side, but I didn't do too badly. For someone who is terrible at sewing, I did all right. But I did this and then realized that I was able to make the really good joke that this is my lady garden. Budum tish. So one of my favourite things to do was whenever someone shouted, I really like your flowers, or something about the flowers on the front of my pants, I would just yell back, thanks, it's my lady garden, and then just watch them crack up as I ran away. And I tell you what, when you run through London in your knickers, I think there's something about the image of just seeing people run in their pants and their sports bras that makes you go oh my god they kind of just understand how exposing that must be and so they're just suddenly compelled to shout nice things at you so I can't even begin to tell you how much support we got yesterday me and my friend Molly stuck together and bless her I was like I know you can run faster than this I know you're holding back because my ankles are essentially mashed potato but she stuck with me the whole way. She ran at my pace. Oh, she was just amazing. And Molly, if you're watching this, I cannot thank you enough. It was just so amazing having you there. Oh. But now I just never want to run a run not in my underwear. Because I know if I wasn't in my pants yesterday, I wouldn't have had nearly as many people shouting at me and spurring me on and that was what kept me going yesterday hearing someone go go on Carrie as you're running past you're like ah! suddenly you get like this flush of adrenaline and endorphins and just amazingness and joy and you just want to keep going it's just the best feeling and the thing is because my name was on the back of my pants the amount of people that would shout my name as I ran past them so I did a lot of that <laughs> whilst I was uh, whilst I was running so you know got a lot of uh, what, what are these called the obliques I got a lot of exercise in my obliques yesterday but as a result of yesterday I have signed up to another 10k today more on that soon because uh, they're waiting for a picture to be made the people that I'm running with they're waiting for like a picture to be made for the fundraising page so once that is up and running I will let you know we are raising money I'll tell you more details as soon as I'm allowed to tell you more details but it's in July I'm really excited about it I don't think any run I do will ever be about being the fastest or the strongest or getting a personal best as much as I would like to get a personal best but I feel like I'm naturally gonna get better at running anyway fingers crossed but after yesterday and just being part of that positive joyful atmosphere and just embracing what my body could do that's what it's always going to be about for me i never want to not run in my underwear because i just that's what i want it to be about and i feel like as soon as i get into like the running gear the more not even other people but the more i am going to start taking it seriously and start like making it about something that I don't want it to be about and I'll start like getting disappointed because I'm not the fastest or because I'm not the strongest and I don't want it to be about that I don't ever want it to be about that I'm not just saying that because I'm really slow <laughs> it is because I exercise for me has never been about like 
punishing yourself buff you know you know how i feel about that if you follow me for long enough like it's never been about like no pain no gain it's never been about pushing myself beyond my limits to the point where it's painful and i'm unhappy it's always been about just embracing what i have i guess mentally how it makes me feel because yesterday i must have looked absolutely crazy running along because i was just grinning through the whole thing and every time we turned a corner there was like a choir singing at us or a big band at one point playing new york new york like the amount of support and love just was so overwhelming that I was just like this the whole way through. I just couldn't stop smiling. And that's what it's about for me. That's what I feel like every run should be about. Honestly, running past that finish line, I was like, I don't care what time I got. I passed the finish line and I had the best time ever. Oh man, it was so good. This is why I've signed up to another one because it was just the best and I cannot wait for the next one. And I feel like because I've done this now, I want to do another swanky pair of underwear. I'm thinking feathers. I'm thinking either like multicolored feathers or doing white feathers and getting a pair of wings to run. <laughs> like attaching a pair of wings to my sports bra. Oh, honestly, I'm always gonna run in my underwear because it's just the best. And I feel like no matter what cause I'm running for, no matter what charity I'm running for, I feel like I'm always gonna be running for body positivity as well. Yes. Oh my God, I never ever in a million years thought after this 10K I'd be signing up for another one. I will let you know more as soon as the team say I can. Yay, I will see you tomorrow.